Hey, this is Trolls from 8DO, and in this video we're going to be demonstrating our Adagio Solo Viola. The Solo Viola comes with four core patches, the first one here being our Legato Instinct, which is around Robin-based Legato. We also have our lovely dynamic bowings and our sort of more general articulations with typical sustains and spiccato, macado, and pizzicatos. And we also have a more sweet, tender type of sweet slur here as well. Um, but without further ado, um, I noticed there was a there's a guy commenting in the previous video that I was talking too much in the beginning of the video. So without further ado, uh, I'm just gonna play a real time impro here of my first viola concerto. And notice that I'm not gonna be touching anything here. It's just purely played out of the box here uh, without any CC knobs, fancy stuff. Um, I'm not so sure about that. Perhaps I'm taking my artistry a little too far here, but I think you get the picture. This baby can play fast and he can play slow as well. And I think that's one of the real beauties of this thing that you can really express yourself a lot with it. We've also gotten a lot of questions in regards to this natural thing here. What does natural legato mean? And perhaps I should just try to demonstrate that. The core of our natural legato is that it's essentially like it's recorded. You don't have all the grafted and added sustains or arcs and all that stuff. This is really straight out of the session. So if you really want to get a feel for what true legato sounds like, that's the patch to play. And yeah, it has these hollow notes. It doesn't connect to anything in the beginning, but you get the perfect round robin based legato when you use it. Let me try to let me try to demonstrate it here, um, and I'm just going to be playing first a couple of hollow notes, and then I'll try to play faster in its natural tempo, so you can get a feeling for what it's really supposed to sound like. And you can see I just switched to the heavy vibrato in the very end of it. So mixing the natural together with an arc is a good idea as well. Let me also try to, uh, I'll just briefly try to just play a very simple thing here and give you an idea about what the actual different uh, arcs and sustains sound like. Obviously the X fade is our cross faded sustains and you can use the, the controls, the CC1 and 11 on that. And you can also use the arcs here to give sort of different feels. So let me just try to play that so you can get a feel for it. And I think you can hear the different types of vibrato as well. It's really one of the reasons we have all these arcs so elaborately in Adagio is an acknowledgement of the fact that a sustain is not just a duh note. There are different types of vibrato they go in and out of it, and that's why we have different ones. And this is a very simple patch. You know, in the ensemble and divisive patches, we have way more different types here. Let me just try to play a little more with it, uh, a little more emotionally, so you can get a feeling for what this baby can, can sound like. And I'm going to try to play some... Let me try to play some more elaborate intervals here to get you a feeling for it. I think one of the sweet aspects about this one is you can hear the true emotion of the player. This is not like synthetic uh, mug-up stuff. You really get a feeling for that beautiful intention it's so important when you work with players that they're invested in it. And I think what we're trying to do here is to have invested notes, so to speak. The next one we have here is our dynamic bowings. We have a lot of those in Adagio. Essentially, I think we have like 49 different types. So this one is actually one of the more humble sets. Uh, let, me just <laughs> let me just try to, to play a little bit here.
And these babies are really designed also to be used with all the different nodes. It's not just necessarily just playing dynamic bowings on their own, but you can also mix them with others. Uh, these guys down here have two bows on them as well, so you can get a little more elaborate kind of da -da kind of tone to them. We should also take just a brief look here at our sustains and sort of more normal articulations. Uh, obviously, we got our crossfaded sustains. Now, I'll try to use that so you can see here in the knob. Spiccato, Mikado, some Pizzicato, and Bartok. And I actually, I'm not a Bartok fan, but I have to say I love it for the solo viola. I don't know. There's just a <laughs> something about it. Let me try. It's so hard to make duh, da 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 da. <laughs> I maybe it's just me. Try it out, like try to make that. It's like the typical 80s ending. Da 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 da. da. Anyway, um, my muscles are not designed for that. Um, the last thing here I want to show, and this is one of our proud moments, I think, for the sol solo viola, is our sweet slur legato here. It has a wonderful tone to it. Um, I think it's one of the legatos we've nailed for solo instruments that has the most emotion in it. And it's kind of funny, you think about it, it's a back burner instrument like the viola. But try to check it out. Let me let me try to play here and I'll, I'll try to play a little more elaborate intervals um, so you can really hear what, what happens if you sort of use it in a more concerto type of context. Uh, let's dabble a little bit here. I'm sorry. You know, the crazy thing about this is that I didn't touch any of the CC controls. I didn't touch anything here. It just played straight as it is. And I think this is a testament to Adagio. Like we've really developed the concept now and we'll continue to develop it moving forward, having all these different types of emotional features. And as you can hear, like very, very elaborate expression when you go through high intervals. And with the Instinct one, we got Ron Robin and the ability to play faster as well. So uh, hopefully you, uh, you've gotten a little sense for our Adagio Soli Viola. We'll see you soon in the next videos.